Hello, third grade. It is good to see you or not see you. You should come to class because uh, we do some fun stuff and we do some stuff that's important for our work. So this week we are doing lesson 15, Harvesting with Conditionals. There are 11 puzzles. Um, they got to be pretty challenging to say the least, but we're gonna go over them right now uh, so you can run the video and watch. So here is the video pertaining to lesson 15. This is the harvester. She runs a big farm and needs your help to pick the crops that are ready to be harvested. Use the move and turn blocks to get the harvester from crop to crop. Then Use the pick blocks to collect all of the corn, lettuce, and pumpkins. The bottom right corner will show you how many are available at that spot. If you see more than one, you'll need to pick the crops multiple times in the same square. Keep an eye out for sprouts. You won't know what crop those are or how many there are until the program is run. So your code may need to check what kind of crop is there before picking it. The sun is shining and it's time to harvest. Let us get started. I don't know if you guys noticed that. Let us get started. Let us get started. Oh dear. You guys are laughing at my jokes. Okay. Now this one is quite a simple one. It says, can, uh, corn, you help me harvest today. Help the harvester check her row of corn to see if anything is ready to pick. Use conditionals to look down each sprout. Each stalk will either have zero or one piece of corn ready to harvest. Now I do want to remember, that's a lot to read. If you need to, click on the speaker. Corn, you help me harvest today? Help the harvester check her roll of corn to see if anything is ready to pick. Use conditionals to look at each sprout. Every stalk will have either zero or one pieces of corn ready to harvest. Okay, so the first thing we're going to put in there is one path ahead. We're going to move forward. Then we're going to use if there is corn, if there is corn, pick corn. And you can always check right here, five out of five blocks. Hit run. Simple, easy. Remember, you can also pause this video as you're working and make the changes, okay? Let's continue on to puzzle three. And I have some, I have some stuff here I'm gonna throw away before I start. Okay, so this is uh, the second puzzle where it says, let us collect both crops from this row. This garden is all mixed up. It has both corn and lettuce. Help the harvester pick the items that are ready for harvesting. Each plant will either will have either one corn or one one lettuce. Okay, so I'm gonna put a repeat block in there because there's one, two, three, four, five, six. We don't know if this is corn or lettuce. So we're gonna move forward. And then if there is a corn, pick the corn. And then we're gonna put if there is a lettuce in the L spot, pick lettuce. So it's not just pick lettuce if there is lettuce because we don't know if, the, if there's anything under these uh, other ones. So hit run. Okay, pretty easy. Number four. Same type of deal. Um, corn, lettuce, and pumpkins. Help me harvest them all. Each plant will, will have We'll have either one piece of corn, one head of lettuce, or one pumpkin. So we are going to break it down, put the repeat button in there, change it to seven. We're going to move forward. And then we're going to put an if else but, um, if else block. If there is corn, pick corn. And then we're going to take an if there is lettuce, and we're, we're going to put it under there, just like we did on the last puzzle. And then we're going to add if there are pumpkins, pick pumpkins. Okay, 
pretty easy. Almost halfway done. Um, gosh, the lettuce is growing in clusters. The harvester wants to pick everything from her lettuce garden. Each, each plant will now have more than one head of lettuce on it. So the harvester will need to keep picking while there is lettuce still growing. Okay, so we're going to put the repeat block six times. One, two, three, four, five, six. We're going to move forward. And then we're going to put while there is lettuce, pick lettuce. And five out of five. So I think that's going to work. Get it again. Repeat six times. Move forward while there is lettuce. Pick lettuce. Number six. Okay. Um, this is a different one. A matter of fact, one of the students showed this one today. So it's repeat until there are pumpkins. Move forward while there is corn. Pick corn. While there is lettuce, pick lettuce. And then the pick pumpkin is going to go underneath both of those. So you have this group nested into the repeat until there are pumpkins, and that should do it. Okay, I'm not sure if that's the way it's supposed to be, but it worked for us. All right, number seven. We use the same type of format, only this time, repeat until uh, repeat until there are pumpkins, do move forward, while there is corn, pick corn, if path to the left, which we see that it's going to go left, turn left, and then pick pumpkins down the bottom. Eight out of eight blocks. Okay, continue on. This was a challenge one. We had a we, we took a little bit of time on this one today. Um, a lot of kids struggle with this one, uh, and, it, and the with the hint up here says notice the easiest path to get all the crocs is a spiral. So we're going to go over. It's going to spiral down. Okay, so we're going to repeat six times. While path ahead, move forward. While there is corn, pick corn. While there is lettuce, pick lettuce. And then we're going to put a turn right underneath wild path ahead. And then pick pumpkin at the end. There's only one pumpkin at the end. next one very similar very very similar puzzle um, repeat until there are pumpkins matter of fact it's almost identical um, it's just a little bit longer you're going to go around a longer path repeat until there are pumpkins while path ahead move forward while there's corn pick corn while there is lettuce pick lettuce and then turn right and then we're going to nest that in there with the pick pumpkin the last thing okay continue the next one is the stairs um, don't know if I have this one yet. Ah! 
Oh, no, I don't have this one. I know what it is. So we're going to move forward. Turn right. Move forward. Turn left. We're going to do that first. And then we're going to put that underneath of it. forward turn right move forward turn left let me see how I get this okay so we have that so we're gonna put all that underneath here throw that away and pick pumpkin repeat seven times then. Let's try to get it right. Okay. Let me show you that show you that again. Okay. So it's repeat seven times and, and that's all the movement. While there is corn, pick corn. While there is lettuce, pick lettuce, pick pumpkin. Okay. And then we can go on to number eleven. Prediction. Um, okay, so it's going to be the harvester will pick all the crops. Okay, number B. I'm going to go number B. So that would be, that would be that would be it for us tonight. Um, I hope that helped. Well, I, I I got that last one wrong. I'm going to look at it one more time. So the answer would have been C. Just for those of you who stuck with me. Okay. Thank you so much. I will see you next week.